Hello everyone and welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video I'm going to show you how to create a force a copy link for any of your Google files. So let's get started. Let's say you have a certain Google file, whether it's a Google Doc, Google Slides, Google Sheets, and you want to share it with others, but you don't want others to do any editing to the main document. So for example, I want to share this document with others. I want them to have a copy. I'm sharing it for, with them so that they keep a copy, but I don't want them to change my document. First, let's see how to share this document. In order to share it, you need to go here to share. And then instead of restricted, select the drop down list and choose anyone with the link and make sure here to choose viewer and not editor, because again, you don't want people who are accessing this file to do any changes to it. So it's going to be viewer. And then you just copy the link in order to share it with others. There's one more step that I prefer you check is you go to the settings here and make sure that viewers and commenters can see the option to download print and copy is selected because you want them to make a copy. It's fine. They can download it. They can make a copy, but they can do changes to the document. Let's press done. And now it's ready to be shared. Let me show you whenever it's shared, how other people will see it. I'm going to, I'm going to go to another user and let's say I pressed on the link of the document. So again, the document is shared with me, but as you can see, I can't do any changes to the document. In order to do changes, I either need to press on request edit access, which is a big problem. And sometimes when you share documents, you receive a lot of requests, but you don't want that person to do changes on the main document. In order for that person to do changes on their own document, they need to go here to file, and then press on make a copy. When they make a copy, now the new copy will be saved on their drive. It's a completely different copy. So press on make a copy. And as you can see, another file, the same file is open, but now it's saved on their drive. So if they do any changes, these changes won't show on your document. It's on their own copy. Let me show you now how to avoid asking or how to avoid people asking you for an edit request. So instead of receiving a lot of edit requests, you can force people or users to make a copy of the document you are sharing. In order to do that, it's very easy. You just go back. Let's go back to the document here to the share. And the link that I got, I'm going to use it, copy link and this link paste it on a Chrome browser, on a document, anywhere you want. Let me just paste it here for now. And I'm going to change this last part here, the part that says edit. I will remove all of these and I will rep replace them with the word copy. So now you have a new link to share it with users for the same document. I'm going to copy the new link. So again, it's the same link, but I replaced it with the word copy at the end. And let me show you when the other users press on this link. So they got the link. It's going to ask them to make a copy. So you can see this document in order to see it, you have to make a copy on your drive. And again, this is useful if you want to keep this copy on other users drive, but you don't want to change your own copy. So whenever they press make a copy, they have this document now on their own drive and they can do any changes they want without affecting your main document. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe to my channel and to press on the notification bell so that you don't miss any of my videos.